probably need your book. I think that okay, for planning, the best, uh, the biggest change, the best change that I made was having yeah, students sorry. look at their own work and look at their own data before they moved forward. Um, kind of helped to create a roadmap for where we were going in the next few days or even in the next few weeks. And if they had a place that they knew that they were starting from, they could use that as a jumping off point for the work, the progress that they needed to make. Smart move, get the numbers down first. Cool, and don't forget, there's more than one right way to do this. Rather than having them speak out to the whole class, they gain a little confidence by collaborating in groups of three or four. And then they can take that information from the three or four together, sort of synthesize it, and create a more complete, meaningful answer when they're asked to share with the whole class. I think uh, for me, one of the big aha moments was actually on test day, which sounds crazy, but we went into the test before the testing instructor started with the instruction. All my students sat down with a piece of paper and started writing out their plan. I had never seen that before. It shows me that they really bought in, they really showed a sense of agency. As soon as we got there, without any instruction from me, before the directions even started, they were sitting down, they were focused with a pen and paper in their hand, and they started making a plan. That rocked my world. I would yeah, recommend. Put them in order. Uh, yeah, there are numbers for you. So I would put them in order by number first. Oh, we always just put in a matching them, then we put them. Sure. Okay. Uh, I don't have a teaching background. I have a philosophy degree and a little bit of business background. So for me, this was a chance to see how other teachers work more than I've ever had an opportunity before. So it was almost a paradigm shift from the way that I was uh, giving instruction in the past to the way I was giving instruction now. I think the biggest shift was having the students really take an active role and, a, and, and, and gain a bit of agency in the classroom so that they knew what they had to do going forward. Awesome. Come on, come on, come on. Where is it?